City of Dallas vying to host the 2026 World Cup, the world's largest sporting event. New for you here at 6 o'clock, Jack Fink shows us what this could mean for all of North Texas. If Dallas is selected as a World Cup host city in 2026, it could generate hundreds of millions of dollars and create thousands of jobs here in North Texas. You know, I see history, I see potential, I see endless possibilities. Under the city's plan, Dallas Park Board President Bobby Abtahi says soccer matches would likely be played at AT&T Stadium and perhaps the Cotton Bowl, along with other events. I see Fan Fest at Fair Park. I see base camps for teams. I picture maybe a, a Team USA practicing here at the Cotton Bowl. And Dallas is also hoping to become the sole site for the International Broadcast Center, where 10,000 media representatives from around the world will broadcast the matches for one month. That's, that has huge impact in hotel rooms, in economic impact, in just really putting Dallas on the map. I see the stadium uh, full. Daniel know, Huerta, who oversees Fair Park, was here in 1994 when Dallas last hosted the International Broadcast Center. Because the Centennial Building and Automobile Building were full of studios, studios from all the various countries all over the world. So it was kind of exciting to walk into those buildings and hear all the interviews taking place. But before that can happen again, FIFA must choose a united bid from the U.S., Canada, and Mexico over Morocco this June. If they do, it wouldn't be until 2020 or 2021 before Dallas finds out if it achieves its goal of hosting the games. Dallas should be selected because we've done this before. We have a history. We have a track record of doing this. In Dallas, Jack Fink, CBS 11 News.